Have a biscuit, Potter. It is Harry Potter time. Or Hogwarts Legacy. I'm not sure if you're allowed to call this Harry Plobber. Man, it has been a while since I played, but... Time... Time gets scarce when you get old. You become an old wizard. You have to put on your top hat and your robe and you have to do adult stuff. Suddenly you have less time. I don't even know if I have less time. Maybe I just have less energy. Lumos. Lumos. Look at me. <laughs> I know that I have the spell Lumos, the very first spell that I learned and forgot. Uh, and I made fun of Harry Plopper for only knowing Expelliarmus. And literally the only spell that I can remember is Avada Kedavra. Every other spell I've learned, I've just forgotten immediately. But it is okay, because I have my silly hat and my legendary dragon glasses. Oh my lord. Professor Fig, I have done bad. I was in the restriction. <laughs> Restri bleh, what a word. Restrict the. Re okay, okay, I give up. <laughs> I'm too old. <laughs> Restricted section of the library. You cannot be serious. Goblins working with Rookwood makes no sense. It is rather unorthodox, to say the least. Unorthodox? It's inconceivable. It's... Ah, Fig. You have a visitor. See what <laughs> the slowest there. reaction time in the world. Hmm. Bye. I have evidence. Augustus so, Rockwood was, was a death eater. restricted section while you were with Professor Black. It was a book we were after. Not that they know who Augustus what? Rockwood is, but... That's... Wait. You accessed the restricted section? But how? Thinking on it, perhaps it's best you spare me the details. Fair enough. In <laughs> fact, the book was below the restricted section as it appeared on the map. I want to hear everything. First, let's have a look. <laughs> I'm just wearing my ass kicking outfit. Look at how cool I look. How is he not commenting on me? Look at my glasses. Oh. Oh dear. Some of these pages seem to be missing. It appears someone has got to the book before us. Still, I will need time to study what remains. Perhaps we can still salvage something useful. Though it may take some time. <laughs> Taking the meta very serious, Fig. As you can tell from my glasses. I think I know, sir. I saw two more memories where I found the book. Another pensive. Godric's heart. The man we saw before, Percival Rackham, was a professor here. The first memory showed him and three other professors using ancient magic to restore a hamlet from a drought. Miriam was right. And the second memory? They were talking to a student who started as a fifth year, like I did. She could see traces of magic too. Why those memories? Hmm. Perhaps this book will explain. Now I'll have to take it with me to London. The headmaster has insisted that I speak directly to the minister about George's death. What are you going to tell them? What will you tell them about Mr. Osric's death? I don't know how much I dare say. George tried to convince the ministry about Ranrock, but to no avail. My instinct is to follow the path we are on for the moment and keep the details to ourselves until we know more. Did he have two wands on his table? Pretty sure he had two wands. I understand. I'll see what I can learn about the missing pages while you're gone. Good. Yeah. Don't neglect your studies. Your wand work is improving by the day. But you'll want to pay attention in herbology and potions. There's more to magic than spell casting. Plenty to keep me occupied while you're gone. You've done exceptionally well. I look forward to seeing all that you've accomplished when I return. Do you hear that? Is oh, it exceptionally well? Don't neglect your friends. You may be surprised by how much you can learn from them as well. Friends? What the fuck are friends? Now there's only one wand! Nah. He has two wands. Now he's hiding it because I saw it and I commented on it. I'm on to you, Fig. You're dual wielding. And I am going to dual wield. It's time to prove your dueling metal and see if we've a new school champion. Meet me at the usual place for the final round of crossed wands. Also, the training dummy is still available. Alright, you know what? That actually might be a good course of action. Because, um... Seeing how little time I have... Oh, gee, this is so confusing. 
Where does it see my quest? Is it under a quest? A uh, cross one's round three. We go there. Seeing how little time I have to actually play, every single time I play. I would like to talk to you about Rookwood and Harlow, and it might be best to do so outside of the castle. We're not gonna hang out with Netze. She's really annoying. Have asked that I teach you an additional defensive spell. Please complete the assignments I have given you, and then proceed to see me in my classroom. How many? Ugh. I play this game to get away from work. I just got like ten emails. No, I don't want to go to her. Stop. This is the world map. Most of the map is covered by fog, limiting what you can see. Hamlets, man, a small community through the world. Uh, whoa, what the heck? Hamlet's provide new opportunities for vendors, flu flames, side quests, and collectibles. Lower Hawksfield is located in the countryside and is a cl yeah, oh, and is the closest hamlet to Hogwarts. In reverence to the school that taught them all, the inhabitants decided on the name Hawksfield. However, around the same time, the villagers of Upper Hawksfield also opted for the name Hawksfield after Hawksmead. Thus, an unhappy compromise was decided upon, and each village added a qualifier to the name. I don't... <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> I want to go kill some Hufflepuffs. As you explore, you'll remove fog and reveal more map, unveiling opportunities like... Ha ha Ooh, dungeons, bandit camps, and many other locations. Very cool. But I am on my way to kill some people. Actually, can I just... I can TP down there. Wait, that's herbology though. Uh, I have a flu flame there. Right, we used the flu flame. Diagon Alley. It's a reference to Harry going to the wrong place. You know what? I want the training dummy for just a while. Where is the training dummy? I am old and stupid. I need a training dummy. Where is the training dummy? Hello? Maybe I'll just talk to you and you give it to me. I like to practice on the training dummy. Let me just give Hello, a combo. <laughs> I'd like to practice with the training dummy. <laughs> oh, the fucking glasses. This time will be a bit more of a challenge. Ready? Huh? It's a training That's dummy. Brilliant. How's that going to be a challenge? I'll set things up. Remember to cast all the spell combinations before the dummy lands again. All right, it gives me if combinations. You need to stop practicing oh, that's fine. Before you finish all of them, let me know. That's fine. All right. You're about to see some magic. So it wants me to do four, three. Excellent four. Thank you. Now what? I did it. Two. Schmack, schmack, schmack. Oh, I accidentally cast one too many. And come on. It was just. I was doing the right thing. One, two, three. Ah, it's because he's so slow, so it, like, it, it, it buffers the input. That's so annoying. <laughs> okay, one, two, three. Nah, but I'm a moron. At least it didn't hit, so it didn't do anything. Oh my god, goodness gracious. Am I too old for video games? I think that's what just dawned on me. I think I'm actually just too impatient. Maybe I'm too young for video games. Thank you. Okay. Pull you in. Schmack. Now I'm super scared of clicking too many times. My wand, it's not working. Now I'm too fast. Okay, that was an insane combo. If I can pull that on a, 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 on a Hufflepuff, he's dead. Impressive wand work. I take to face you in a duel. Chai latte. You've been a great Chai latte. Oh, stop. It is just blush. amazing. Seriously, well done. Training dummies will think twice before challenging you again. I don't think the training dummies You're are going to challenge me again, you dummy. Ones. Other duelists had better beware. Okay, let me try dueling. Going to embarrass myself. Let's roll. Protego. That's Protego, right? Yeah. So we have roll, we have Protego. Roll, Protego. Then everything else doesn't matter. Hello, it's just Luke. roll and Protego. Is the final round of cross ones ready? Big match today. It all comes down to this. 
the moment that we find out if your training and dedication is enough to win it all. Is this the finale? Ready for a shot at glory? Huh? Sure. I certainly am. Brilliant. Are you dealing with a partner? Sebastian Shallow. Yes, Sebastian. Then let's get started. We like Sebastian more than Nelly. We can make this a real victory. That's the spirit. I shall kill you all. What what are those prepared ones? Did you preload a spell? Breakthrough ritual with damage spells. Alright, I got it. Also, someone told me that my fire spells are way shorter range than I thought they actually were. Wait, oh, it's too slow, I guess. I can figure this out. Don't worry about a thing. There, I did it. Oh no, it's only damage spells. Oh, I don't have one loaded. Ow. There, we broke through. Then we levitate him. Stop, I'm doing my combo. I'm practicing my combo. I think I am low on HP right now. I'm doing it. Oh, that does count as a damage spell. Very nice. You gotta remember that. We're getting the hang of it. So fucking focused right now. Can we hit him with the finisher? Luma's Maxima. Oh shit. <laughs> I shouldn't start fucking around. I'm gonna die. Yes, die. I mean, good game. I mean, I don't think anyone expected me to win that one. I didn't What's expect to win that one. You've won the tournament. Did I button mash? Some would say yes. Some would be right. It's an honor. I got lucky. I'm just getting started. I got lucky. It was mostly luck, that's all. Please, you wouldn't have got this far on luck alone. Now, to the victor goes the prize! And so it is my great honor to present you with this simple yet elegant token of supreme dueling accomplishment. Oh, it was pure luck. What a Harry Potter thing to say. I don't know that I deserve this. I'm going to be really humble. I'm flattered, but I And then I'm going to kill them. Come now. Cuz I'm a Slytherin. You're undisputed winner. You should revel in your accomplishment. Yes. Now that we've definitively crowned the tournament winner, I suppose I should get back to my schoolwork. Wonder how my herbology plants are doing. I haven't tended them in ages. Stop telling me about herbology plants. Wait, what did I get? I got a cross ones dueling thing. There's no way that was the final. There's gonna be more than that. There's gonna be more than that. Like, there's no way that was it. Um, herbology class. Every oh, damn it, I don't. Everyone keeps telling me to go to herbology. I don't really care about plants. I'm not Neville. Maybe some gillyweed. So I don't need to breathe. At least underwater. That'd be kind of cool. Wait, where'd I have to go? Oh, I guess I'm not tracking it. Eh. Track. There we go. Nah, I'm just kidding. Herbology class is probably pretty cool and useful. You got the mandrakes and you can make um, regions for your po- You know what? No, I don't like herbology. <laughs> Potions class. That's cool. That I can rationalize. Herbology, not so much. Alright, let's try it out. Some useless class. Good morning, Professor Garlic. How wonderful it is to see you again, Lenora dear. Okay, I care about herbology. Today's class. Uh, um, uh, a little treat for your auntie. Oh my god. I love herbology. Oh, hello. Hi. Class. Please welcome the newest rose in our garden. 
We do look forward to growing together. She called me a rose. How thrilling! Oh, she's dreamy. To back we like again. her. This year will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in herbology is knowledge. The prudent herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacular than the bouncing bone. Now then, today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the mandrake root. Uh. Akio. <laughs> mandrake, no matter what in herbology, it's always the mandrake. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? <laughs> First, let's protect our ears. Hmm. Was that cotton or garlic? Now, everyone, grip their mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. I think I literally just put a garlic clove in my ear. Whatever she says. Oh my. I work with children. This is nothing. Nothing to me. This is a Monday. Hmm. Guess you could put them in soil to get them to stop. Usually just crush up some Valium in the drinking water. Dirty blanket, putting the mandrake right at ease. Repair. I'm very sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. All right then, off you go. Splendid work, everyone. Now for our next task, I love her. we'll be planting dittany at our potting tables. You can all get started. Huh? I need to have a brief word with our new student. What's that? What's that class? Mm. <laughs> that was like I 30 seconds. Like I'm supposed to catch up and you gave me a 30 second... Ooh, I wonder what happens if I use fire. In sorry, sorry. The slithering came up in me. Hi, Garlic. Um, would you like my num... I mean, uh, great, great lesson. Yes, Professor. Oh, why am I wearing these stupid glasses? Idiot, idiot. It's funny until there's a hot girl. I nearly went deaf. Deaf, deaf, deaf. I enjoyed it. Loved it. Actually, I enjoyed it. I couldn't help but catch your enthusiasm. How kind of you. It seems you're already taking to herbology like a mandrake to fresh soil. Now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Pick them up in Hogsmeade. You visited the magic meep. Wonderful! A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the classroom. It wasn't easy to spare one on such late notice. Plant the seeds there now, and you can return to harvest them later. Even with soil, sunlight, and a bit of magic, they will take time to grow. Her hair is going kind of crazy. Let's this is see. jiggling all over the place. Not normally what I want to see jiggle, but whatever. <laughs> Fucking hair physics. Game developers will never figure that out. She's a little bit airy when she talks. In the Wiganweld potion, as you all should know from Professor Sharp's class. Who the hell is Professor Sharp? Okay. Dittany. The leaves of this medicinal herb are used in Wiganweld Potion. Dittany seeds can be purchased at the Magic Meep, Meep, Meep and can be grown in pots of any size. Essence of Dittany. Wiganweld Bark. Oh, it's actually timed. Huh. I wonder if that also goes when I'm not in game. I conjured a rain cloud. Um, you can add fertilizer to this plant to increase its yield. You can create fertilizer by conjuring a dung compost co composter. Uh, I did it. Well done! Once it can be harvested, your dittany will be ready to use in Wiganweld potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about that. Now, what say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora, the Chinese chomping cabbage. You'll find that some plants are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately, 
I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Be a dear, and let them have a good chomping. Yes, Professor. They're in the other greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading out of this room. Your classmate, Mr. Pruitt, has kindly offered to accompany you. Come back and see me when you're finished. Oh, and mind your fingers. They do bite. I also have a dummy for you to gnaw on. No, no, no. 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 Uh... Now remember, a wand is not a trowel. What am I doing with my life? I'm gonna cut that out. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. Fuck me. Where, 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 I don't even... Meet with Leander Previt... Hello. Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. I'll be showing you the Chinese chomping cabbages. Up these stairs will take us there. But, your lead. Okay. <laughs> I guess I'll lead. Nice work in Defense Against the Dark Arts, by the way. Thank you. Excuse me. Your duel with Sebastian. And he's good. <laughs> Thinks he's really good. But you outright slaughtered him. It was brilliant. I did. He's oh. dead. No longer breathe. Oh. Thank you. Oh. I need to put Sebastian in his place myself. I mean, I would have if Hecate hadn't stopped me. Didn't she stop that dragon skull from crushing you? <laughs> Here we are. Home of the Chinese chop. Go on. Oh, I wasn't even supposed to. Just oh, I guess I just stole something cabbage. upstairs. Now, huh. see that dummy? Just toss the cabbages at it, and they'll do the rest. Um. How? Hold tab. For the tools wheel. Oh. Quipper trumping cabbage. Look at that. They'll chomp on anything they can get there. Mouths on. <laughs> Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the denoming, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. Can I pick it up again? Okay. Vicious little nope. bastards, aren't they? My kind of plants. Not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. The kind of plants that just have your back in a fight. Uh, not saying you can't go it alone, but well, imagine that wasn't a dummy. <laughs> I take the matter very seriously, as you can tell from my dragon spectacles. Hmm. I was imagining it already. Yes. This can eat. Trust me, Leander. I was puff. imagining it the entire time. You were. I mean, of course. You're uh, not someone to be trifled with. I see that. Dogweed and Deathcap has more of them, if you're keen. Other plants, too. Ones your parents wouldn't plant in the garden. You get the idea. Anyway, we uh, probably ought to head back to class. Take but class it. ended. I'll I'm so confused class. about class. She said, well, would you wish it for today? In her airy, airy voice. She's so happy. Like, what? what were her parents happy or something? She's so very light and everything is beautiful. Oh, I guess we, we still do class. Right. As to why we should always wear our dragon hide gloves. I shall end our lesson. I tended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, Professor. Remarkable plants, aren't they? I hope they weren't too much trouble. Oh, don't see any bite marks or missing digits. And good, as you do seem to be quite green-fingered. Oh, I'm eager to see your skill in the soil continue to blossom. <laughs> oh, this is how you fail a class. <laughs> Roll up in my pimp hat. My dragon glasses, and I just straight up tell her, I don't give a shit about your plants. I love them. Magical plants have so much to offer. I'm eager to learn more. I'm glad. Herbology is a bounteous subject. Tend to your garden, and it will tend to you. Huh. Well, I suppose that's everything. Do come by for a chat sometime. I so enjoy checking in with my new students. I actually really wanted to grow my own food, like vegetables, cabbages, uh, potatoes, and carrots. But I figured out it, it's not worth it. That was a bummer. So... Where else? Can I plant anywhere? No. Nope. Maybe I just need the seeds, or how do I get more pots? Okay, I actually have no idea. Let's see for the quests. What do we do for the quests? The girl. <laughs> you wagger. 
That's a no. I don't I don't particularly enjoy hanging out with her. Potion class. That sounds cool. We got Hecate's assignment. I really like Hecate. She's really cool. Like a moth to a frame. Um, find a second landmark on the treasure map and go up to go up. I think we do potions class. I think that is uh, the way to go. But we did herbology class. I think this is a natural way to, to end the episode. I'm hanging out with Professor... Let me, let me just... No, no. Don't leave me. I'm hanging out with Professor Garlic. She loves me. She's really trying to get away. She loves me. Stop. Beautiful girl. Very pretty. Yeah. Herbology class. Pretty cool. I like that they implemented you can actually fight with it. This is a... Uh, it's a cool system. And I can't wait to use this on, a, on an unknowing Hufflepuff. Unbewitted? Is that a word? I don't know. Love you guys, and I'll see you around for the next episode of Harry Plopper. Nox.